Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's Big Rob YT here with my setup video. At last, everyone's been waiting for it. I've been talking about it for ages. I've been waiting for stuff to come in from sponsors. Everything's in now and we're all set up and ready to go. So we're gonna get on with the setup video. If you've got any questions or any comments or anything, leave them in the comments below. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoy it. First things I want to mention is the two sponsors that are sponsoring my YouTube channel. So the first one is Iyama. And here is the box for one of the screens that they sent me. So these are the part of the G Master range, which is their gaming monitors, 144 megahertz. Uh, refresh rate, one millisecond response time, full HD. I didn't go for 4K because I'm running three of them, and I want to make sure that I've still got power left for the computer to do other things. So, definitely really, really good screens. Um, I'll be able to show you here. That's uh, one of the screens set up on my PC. There's one of the screens set up on the Mac, and the other one set up on the Mac. And they're really, really good. I uh, get really good graphics really good resolution um, so their screens are really really good it's specifically a gaming edition it's got like DVI HDMI uh, display port and all the different connections that you'd need audio and everything like that they do some more higher-end ones with USB and different things like that as well so they're really good so thanks to them there'll be a link in the description to show their products and uh, yeah you can check them out and see what you think and the next thing I want to show is the Logitech stuff. So, I've spoken to Logitech. Logitech are happy to be a sponsor of the channel. They've sent me some bits and pieces, so let's have a look and see what we've got. Hopefully, as and when they've got new gaming products coming out, they'll send them and I'll be able to show them to you guys and use them in my videos and see how they get on. So we've got a gaming keyboard, a gaming mouse that they sent, a gaming headset and a gaming mouse mat and I've actually got these set up so there's the headset which is really nice and I've got the keyboard and the mouse I've got the old mouse there as well which was a Logitech as well and the mouse and the headset are actually in sync with each other when they change colour both of them stay the same colour and it gives me an additional headset to use as well when I'm PC gaming and stuff so that's pretty good okay so here we've got the main setup let me see if I can get as much of it in focus as I can So I want to try and keep the setup video as quite as basic as, as I can while giving as much information as I can. So down here we've got my Mac Tower which is a dual Xeon processor, 32 gig of RAM, 4 gigabyte graphics, it's got 4 one terabyte drives running RAID Hooray for all my video recording and it's running the operating system all off an SSD. And I've got on that, I've got my Razer keyboard and mouse. Now the Razer keyboard's not lit up at the minute, I don't know why. But Razer keyboard and mouse and a normal Apple keyboard. And then I've got my controllers at the back, which are made by Euphonics, which is now owned by Avid. Um, so I've got motorized mixing desks. I can do any of my editing with this, any of my audio, any of the video editing. I've got like a, a jog wheel that I can use. And, they're well handy to use with Final Cut Pro and Logic, so I use those quite a bit when I'm editing. And obviously I've got two screens running off of the uh, Mac Pro, so that when I'm video, video editing I've got dual screen and okay, stuff. Okay, so I've got this rack unit, uh, it's like a 19 inch rack, uh, 12U, it's got a glass fronted door, it's got fans in it to keep things cool. This is where a lot of the business stuff is. So. That box there that you can see with all the round dials with the blue round them is my audio capture device. So I plug all my keyboards into that. I can plug microphones and things into that and I can do audio editing. And below that is a switch and that's all the networking in the house. So I've got two NAS boxes underneath for like network attached storage. 
which all connects to the Switch. And I got my Xbox 360, which you can see, and load of Xbox games and Xbox controllers. <laughs> and up here, got the uh, Xbox One and my Astro headphones which I use only pretty much for when I'm playing on the Xbox. So turn that off, that's a bit of a fail. Uh, so yeah, that's my uh, Astro headphones uh, up there. And then this is the main PC, which looks like a wreck. Uh, I've got the hard drives on the floor, some of them not even plugged in because I'm having configuration issues, and the computer's that old that the graphics card in there, none of this actually closes and the side doesn't go in the case and stuff so it's a really old Dell PC it's still a dual Xeon 32 gig of RAM uh, it's running an SSD and a 1060 GTX graphics card so it's still quite good but it's just old I'm waiting to build a new unit up and then over here I've got one two three of my keyboard set up uh, for when I do any audio stuff, I don't get to do the audio stuff as much as I'd like, but I got my keyboard set up, so yeah, I'm hoping to start doing some more audio. So just to let you know, behind the monitors, I've got these brackets, so they actually hold the monitors up in the air for me, and there you can see one of my studio speakers, which are my KRK speakers. I've got two of those, they're really good, really, really good for any kind of audio reference and stuff. So the way I've got it set up, just to give you a bit of outline, um, and I don't know if you can see it under there, all those cables at the back, I've got HDMI out from the PC to the Mac, so whatever I play on the PC will appear on the Mac, and then I can capture it on the Mac, and the PC is just literally doing PC gaming, all of my Discord is on my Mac, all my streaming's on the Mac, all the rendering is all on the Mac, everything else is on the uh, PC, just for gaming. So yeah, I hope you uh, like the setup video, I've got a Logitech webcam there, ready to do face cam, and I've got a Logitech webcam there, ready to do more, and to do different angles, so yeah, that's it really. The only other thing left to show you is my Blue Yeti microphone, uh, pop filter, and my road arm that I use it for it, so that's what I use for all my audio and uh, my logo on the wall. So, yeah, I uh, hope you really enjoyed the video. If you've got any questions about any of the setup configuration or any of the products that I use, um, let me know and uh, I'll try and answer all your questions as much as possible. So, apart from that, I hope you enjoyed it and uh. We'll see you next time.